Hello, welcome to our Listo para Leer series. My name is Dr. Robert Rodriguez, and I'm a trustee of the National Museum of Mexican Art. And today I'm going to be reading the book, The Sandlot, A Story of Inclusion and Embracing Diversity, by, written by Carolyn and Amalia Furlow, illustrated by Madison Reeves. So let's begin. The Sandbox, A Story of Inclusion and Embracing Differences. One day, Imani looked up at the big yellow sun. She felt warm rays kiss her cheeks, and she said, what a beautiful day, she thought. I think what well, I will take a walk, she said to herself. All of my friends will be at the park, and we love playing in the sandbox. Look, there goes Alba. Imani ran toward her friend. Are you going to the park, Alba? Yes, Alba answered and smiled. Great, we can walk together, Imani said. The two girls started walking. One step, two steps, three steps. Look up at the big green tree, Imani shouted. It's so pretty, Alba exclaimed as they skipped along. Imani studied Alba and said, Alba, your hair is straight. Alba nodded. Yes, and your hair is curly, Imani. Alba looked and said, hey, look, our skin is different too, Imani added. I'm brown, you're beige. That's awesome. Suddenly, their friend Tao jumped out from behind a tree. Boo! Imani screamed and Alba started to run away. And Tao just laughed, don't be scared, it's only me. Are you on the way to the park? Imani asked Tao. Yes, I am. Good, said Alba. We can walk together. Look, Imani, Tao has black hair too, but his eyes are different from yours and mine. But they're still pretty, like flowers in a garden. Imani said. What does that mean? I'm not a flower, Tao pouted. Of course not, Alba Imani said together. But we're like all the flowers in the garden, said Imani. Isn't it beautiful? Hey, Ella came running down the sidewalk. Wait up, guys. I want to walk with you. Hi, Ella. The three friends were happy to see her. Come play with us in the sandbox, Tao said. Look, Alba, Imani said. Ella's hair is yellow and straight. And her eyes are blue, added Alba. We're all different, Tao laughed. But that's what makes it fun. Yes, Alba smiled. She is another flower in our garden. Imani's eyes twinkled. Our garden is full of many colors and many different types of flowers. Happily, they exclaimed, that's awesome. I like flowers, said Ella. What flower am I? You're a daffodil, they all said together. Tao did flips and the three girls skipped along holding hands. Look, there's the park, Imani pointed. Wiz was sitting on the edge of the sandbox. Hey guys, look at the bugs I caught. One, two, three. Wiz pointed at the bugs in his bottle. They each looked different. The first was a pretty butterfly with many colors. The second was a brown, black, and tan beetle. The third was a bright green grasshopper. They were all different and they were each beautiful. Those bugs are like flowers in our garden, Imani said. They are all different, and they're all beautiful, exclaimed Alba. The five friends laughed and played in the sandbox. Look, Ella said, Wiz's hair is bright red. It's curly too, Imani added, and his eyes are blue. What kind of flower is Wiz? Alba smiled. I think he's a rose. The children laughed and told Wiz about how they were all like flowers in a garden. 
Abu's long black hair blew back as he ran and jumped into the sandbox. Hey, everybody, what are you doing? We are playing in the sandbox, Wiz responded. You can play with us. Everyone welcomed Abul with smiles. Look, Abul is different too. He is a boy with long black hair, Alba explained. Tao questioned, can you imagine what it would be like if we all looked the same? Boring, they all shouted. I am happy we all look different, Ella said. Imani clapped her hands. We're like all the different colored flowers in the garden. Everyone shouted, that's awesome. Let's go play in the sandbox together. The end. I hope you enjoyed today's The Sandbox, a story of inclusion and embracing differences, written by Carolyn and Amelia Furlow. Thank you.